What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're going to be playing some more 7 Days to Die. Continuing from last episode. I pretty much got beat up by a bunch of those big snow zombies. Well, lumberjacks. And then I tried to fight a cougar. Which was not a good idea. So I'm probably going to have to battle that cougar again. To get my bag back so I'm gonna be gonna try to make another spear and try to get him and I was trying to search for the name of what that symbol is in the left hand corner but it's the grim grim reaper that's that symbol that I was trying to explain in the last video so my XP would go all the way down to the end and it'll turn back blue and I can I can earn XP again. How's that made? I need six wood. Like that. Okay. Oh I need five stone. Okay. Stone should be around in here somewhere. Here's some right here. Well, one. And I need to find more stone. Stay away from that zombie. Other one. Alright, that should be enough. To jump back up to the top okay I just caught that out the corner of my left eye which is a wolf up here a gray one let's see if we can get it probably gonna tear us up a little bit Yeah, almost instantly they make you bleed okay we got him but I'm bleeding I can't do nothing about that because I don't have cloth but I can make cloth but that's not gonna help me regain my health back All right, let's go try to get my bag. All right, we're back over here, and there he is. I'm going to try to get him again. Okay, so that definitely was the same one that I was hitting inside that. So it all it took was one hit. So that's good. Um, I don't have any bones in my inventory, do I? No. Go ahead and do this. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and make a bone shell. Right there. And we're gonna go ahead and cut him up. Probably get more meat than what we were doing with the axe. Alrighty. Um. I really need to loot some some things. I'm probably gonna try to loot this house right here that's falling apart. Cause it looks like there's a couple things up there. Covered up by something. There's definitely going to be some zombies in here. I just don't know how many. Okay, there's something right there and something right there. There's got to be something back there. Go ahead and get my frames out.
All right, let's see what's back here. Oh, okay, a munitions box. Please let there be something good in it. Okay, some military stuff, some ammo. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put that military stuff on and might... Might help out a little bit. I highly doubt it, but... We'll see. Alright, we got us a uh, desk safe, but... I think I left the lock picks back at the house or back underground. Okay, where did that come from? So there's one right there. There's one right there. Alright, so yeah, he's probably gonna follow me, both of them. Oh, and then there's a. What? A fire zombie inside the snow? That doesn't make sense. Okay, that's great, that one's hitting that one. Oh, come on, really? Well, I'm probably dead now. How many more seconds of bleeding do I have? Nine? Yeah. We're gonna be pretty low health. Alright, let's go see if we can get him again. Okay, got that one. He's dead. That one's not. A couple more hits. And he should be dead. Okay, he's dead, and we're level 10 already now. I'm gonna get my spear back from him. Okay. I had to go all the way down there just to... I did. Oh no, there he is. What? Okay, there was just one out here. And now he reset himself? Come on now. Definitely don't want to get hit by him because he'll probably catch me on fire. So if I'm not mistaken, that should be all of the zombies in here. Okay, some more things. Search this sink. Some nitrate powder. Oh, the, uh... Chrysanthemum seeds? I used to say that wrong, but I actually heard somebody say it while watching them play this, and... I kind of got used to saying it now. Pretty much been... A trash place. I know I've got a couple things up another level. But I want to make sure I got everything out of here. There's a desk safe right there. That's the same one that we saw. Yeah, there was something up here, wasn't there? Oh yeah, a food pile. Yeah, food pile, and then you got a water bottle with some purified water in it. Weapons bag, please be something. Oh, a handgun. Perfect. And we got a regular knife. Alright, guys, I got my hunger up. Uh, Probably not to a level where I wanted it. Well, it's, 72 is not bad. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and go over here and fetch this uh, supply drop before it gets nighttime. 
Uh, this helmet's probably making me hot. So I'm gonna take it off. Alright, so, and my stamina's going back up, and my health. And that purified water works really good. Because it, uh, ooh, there's something over there. That just caught my eye over there. Oh, you know what? It's another town. You know what? Screw that snow town. I'm gonna go to that town from now on. Because that one doesn't seem like it's... Yeah, it's in the good zone. It's in the green zone. Okay, that really scared me because that zombie looked really, really skinny. Let's go ahead and get our first kill with a gun. Totally missed that one shot. Got him. Three shots with a gun. Now that is awesome. Yeah, why not? Let's do another one. Good XP, I missed that shot. Now, I, I shouldn't be using it as much as I'm using it. Because uh, this will help out with the cougars and the dogs and the wolves. That would help out greatly because then they wouldn't have to touch you. Generally speaking, they wouldn't have to touch you. Okay, there was a road that way the whole time. Might as well search some of this stuff. Should have enough of time to get back to the house before it turns nighttime and all the zombies, zombies are running at you. Okay, that rabbit scared the crap out of me, but I just got something that's going to help me with mining. I got repair kits so I can repair my pickaxe, but I'm not going to repair that one because I have a level 3, which is a lot better. Oh, there's the lock picks. And that safe might, might be worth going back into, going back into the cold for. It might. I don't know. We'll see as the episodes go on. Oh, here's an empty bag. Well, not really because that bow is pretty good, but I don't really like bows in this game. Now, the crossbow is good. I really like that one, but the regular bow and arrow? Nah. Give me a crossbow or a gun. Alright, I can't loot much more because I have to save room for this supply crate. So there's going to be some good stuff in there, hopefully. Oh, here it is. Alright. Nothing real close. Except for that thing. Alright, let's see. Uh, I'll take the ammo. I like the ammo, the food. And the health kit and the beaker. The beaker is awesome. Because now I don't have to search for one. Is that a screamer? No. Looked like a screamer. Alright, I'm going to head back to the base. And I will see you guys there when I return. As you guys can see, I had a little interruption because I heard the dog running behind me because I was running away from the zombie. But uh, I'll use the gun on the zombie because I just got a bunch more bullets. But uh, yeah, I turn around and here's the wolf running at me. So I'm definitely going to get the meat off of him. Oh yeah, that's some good meat. Alright. I'll see you guys when I return. Alright guys, we are back to the base. 
I probably should protect that a little bit better at the top, like make a, make a hatch. But I don't have time for that right now. Because we have all this loot. Which is amazing, which means some of this stuff I'm probably gonna have to put in the other chest. Yep. And that didn't go in there, so I never did have lock picks. So that will be great for next time. Next time I go out. Uh the forge. I wanna see. What I have to have, the clay, leather, and duct tape, and short iron pipe. Let's see if I can get that right now. I'm pretty sure I'm, I have that. Alright, so I don't see it on the list no more. So there we go. We got us a forge making. But, that's going to be the end of this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Finally got a gun, so I can go into the cold if I want to. A little bit more. Um, found some more ammo in the supply crate, which is great. Uh, I think I have them set for every day, so they'll come down every day at 12 o'clock. So, that'll help us out a lot. And we found that town that was, uh, in the neutral area. I call it neutral area because there's not any extreme weather. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys on the next video.